Hey farmers, what's going on? And welcome back to another Haiti hey video. Now, in this video, we're going to be talking about Haiti Friends Bar, Friends Book, and the Haiti Tag. Yes. So let's just start the game. Let me have a look at what this farm. No, I'm not going to sell them. No, sorry. And by the way, guys, I'm preparing for the the Wizards Double Coins event that's coming tomorrow. So what I'm basically doing is I'm going to the paper and filling up my barn with all the paper food. Um, what I mean by paper food is basically the things that are usually found in the paper. For example, wrestling bouquets, cloche hats, um, tofu dogs, chili popcorn, stuff like that. Uh, because I think you can get a really good amount of profit from the farm of visitors. So that's what I'm doing and I'm buying all of these things. Um, I don't usually do this. But now I'm doing this because I have a lot of space in my barn and I think it's a really good idea to just to make a lot of profit from these farm wizards. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to purchase a few things from the paper. Let's see. Um, all right, let's get the eggs. Anyways, let's get these hats and all right, let's just get them. It's taking so long to load. All right, we're going to get that as well. Oh, somebody has sale my neighbor hood. Let's see if the sale is still available. Oh, that's that's a good thing. We can get that. And I need carrot pies as well. Let's see if I can help. Um, it's a town help. Never mind. Let's go to another farm over here and see if I can purchase. Yeah, let's get all these things. And let's go over here. Mm, yeah, that's a lot. My barn is getting full. I'm sure you guys can see they've got like 396 of the rustic bouquets. And I really hope that I'll be able to sell them. So we are just going to send that and let's just collect the honeycombs and harvest some crops if I can. Yep, I can do. I've got beetroot. This is a new crop. And we've got some soybean, then I just got a TNT and a plank, which is brilliant. Let's see if I can plant now. I'm going to go with corn and carrots because I think that is what is important. Okay. I think it's done. All right, guys. Now I'm going to be talking about the friends at bar. So what is a friends bar? If you have a look at the bottom left corner of the game, you can see there's a tab, a circle tab, which has three group of people. I mean, three people are together. It's a group of people. So once you tap on that, um, there's a bar that gets opened. Now there are a total of five categories on this bar. So first of all, let's see all the categories that we have. So the first category is always your neighborhood logo. For example, the neighborhood that currently I'm in has a dog behind a scare red shape. So that's the logo that we have. It's a dog. And here you can see all your neighborhood members. For example, the highest level player that is in my neighborhood is currently 196. That's Katie's place. Then you can also see the town level that's up there. That's 65. And you can see Farm Fresh, Breadman, and there are a lot of players in my neighborhood. So it starts from the highest level and ends at the lowest level. So the lowest level player that's currently in the neighborhood is 61 Woodside Farm and the town level is 15. Now please remember that you cannot see the town level for other friends. You can only see the town level of your neighborhood members. The next is the help sign. It shows all the friends that you have in your bar or your friends book that needs help at the farms. So um, basically a lot of things have changed now. For example, now you guys can see there's a chicken profile. Before it did not use to show the chicken profile. It used to show the um, a kind of person, but now it shows the chicken, which I think is really cool. So for example, if I go over here, it shows that the person needs help. So we're just going to help them. There they go. And so you can see there are a lot of friends that are asking for help. And at the end, you can see your neighborhood friends that are asking for help. So it's a good, really good opportunity to go ahead and help your members, especially when there are like double XP or coins events or when you're on a derby task, uh, make sure you go around and help other people out. The third category that we have over here is basically called as last helpers. Now, these are the people that has helped you with your farm. Now, you guys recently saw that um, I just sent a few thank you card to a person that helped my nectar bush. So that is what we have over here. Let me just show you guys. All right, so over here you guys can see level 92. Then we've got a lot of farms that has helped me. Now, please remember these all these 
friends or like people that help you stay there for a maximum of seven days. Now, I think it's on seven. I think it's probably three days and then they get vanished. So there will be nothing over here. And the main category you have here is all your friends. All the friends that you've followed, that you've added are present here. And the first farm is of Greg's. Obviously, that's uh, Supercell itself. Then you got your Facebook and Google Play. Now, if you connect your game with the Facebook, you will have all those friends that are present or added in your Facebook account that also play Haiti. Um, and if you connect your game with Facebook, um, the chicken profile will be banished and you will see their actual Facebook profile. So you guys can see that I have a lot of friends. I accept everybody. I do not reject anyone unless somebody's behaving really rudely. So you guys can see that I have a lot of players ranging from level um, 300 to level 100, 90, 80, 70, and everything that I have. Now close to the friends, there's another tab called as the followers. Now, these are the people that are not basically added into your friends bar, but these are the ones that you, no, no, I'm sorry. These are the ones, people that are actually following you. So let me just have a look. How many followers do I have? Ooh, I got 147 followers. That's cool. I haven't checked. It's been a while. So oh, a lot amount of people are following me and I think it's all because I sell a lot of cool things. So yeah, I remember a few of them. It's been a long time since they're following me, but that's cool. I mean, it's kind of cool to have followers in there. And so yeah, that was all about your friends bar that you have in the Heyday. Let me just put some more dairy. All right guys, the second thing that I'm gonna be talking about is going to be the in-game friends or the friends book, which was added back in December, 2016. So it's almost been like three years since we had this great feature. So in the picture, you can see you've got your incoming results, you've got your friend farms, and you can see that before, when this was newly added, the limit used to be 100, but it's changed now, and that's what I'm gonna show you guys now. Now, before I talk about the friends book, I wanna talk about the three colors that are present in your friends bar. So there's a blue badge, which basically shows the farms that you are following. For example, I'm currently following the highest level player, BDR, He's on level six, um, 647, he's doing really cool. So I'm following him and that will show me in a blue color. The next ones are your simple friends that you just added and they get showed in a yellow color, you guys can see. And the next one that you show, um, you see, is basically a green one. Now, these are the people that you've added from your neighborhood members. So that was it. Now, if you guys see on the very left corner of the friends bar, you can see there's a book. If I tap on this, the show me it's called as the friend book. Now, friend book is basically a more upgrade and a more customized version of the friends bar in which you can manage all your friends requests and block people more efficiently and more easily. So I'm going to show you guys what you can do in here. Now, first of all, if you want to accept requests, it's cool. If you don't, just go into the settings over here and just turn it off. Now, I personally don't do this because I love to accept people and I like when people send me requests. It's kind of cool. So I just don't like turn it off. I know a lot of people turn it off and they get full, um, but I remove people and I add other people because I don't want to reject people. I just don't like it. I think it's kind of rude. But anyways, it's your game. Whatever you want to do, it's cool. And the next thing is Heyday tag. So my tag is 2YUQPURL. I think I've learned it by heart now and yeah, it's cool. So I think I have a little glitch in my friend's book. If I tap on my friend's book, it shows me that I want friend request. It shows one, but when I tap on it, it shows nothing. And I have no idea why this is happening. I think it's been an year since it's happening and I just don't know why it shows me like that. Does anyone know why it happens? It's kind of cringy and weird. All right, guys. Now, friends book has a tag. So tag is a specific code that distinguish each player from other player. Now, for example, I'm going to add my own. Um, if I write my tag, let's see, hashtag. No, the hashtag is always present too. Y-U-Q-P-U-O-R-L. And then I'm going to search. So it shows myself. Hey, every day, stay home. Um, and of course, you cannot add yourself as a friend, but if you know the tag of other people, you can put it right here and then you can add them. So yeah, that's cool. And the next one is in-game friends. Now, these are the friends that you've added from your friends book by searching their code. So you can see that I've got like 248 over 250 and it shows me full. I don't know why. Technically, it should be 250 over 250, but it shows me 248. So these are all the friends 
I've got a lot of friends in my friends bar, so you guys can see. You've got Phoebe, Ricky, um, I've got a lot of Haiti YouTubers as well. So yeah, cool, got a lot of friends. And then you have your other friends, which basically are your Facebook friends. N now, I have not connected my game to the Facebook because I don't like it. If you've connected your game to the Facebook, you will sh um, see all the people that are in your Facebook right here. And the next one is followers. Now, these are the people, it shows you the farms that you are following and the people that are following you. Now, currently I'm following BDR, June, um, one of my members. Um, you got Superside, I'm following him. And so yeah, that's cool. You can follow up to 10 people and I'm currently following only eight. And if you go over here, you can see I've got like 147 followers, which is amazing. I'm great and a lot of people are following me. Now, let's talk about how to manage your friends book. Now, currently you can only add up to 250 friends and I really hope that Haiti increases this limit because I think it's kind of low. So what I'm gonna do currently, I'm about to remove some people from my friends book that I think are inactive or that I don't really know are they're just they just haven't been playing the game for a while because um i know a lot of people send me requests and my book gets you know full and it's not cool so i'm just gonna go down and down and i don't really know who i have here so we've got abc which i don't know who so i'm just gonna remove that um i've got green acres no i'm just gonna remove that as well um and i've got lucifer that's crazy just, just gonna remove that and then we've got um a lot of i think i know them so that's cool. Let's see who else can I remove from here. I'm just going to remove this person. I don't really know. All right. That is cool. Okay. I think that's being removed. Let's see what else I can remove. That's cool. We've got Chris HD, um, Ace Ball Farm. I'm not really sure, but we shall see. All right. We are just going to remove this person and we're going to remove Gamer Kitty as well. And we do have a lot of people. I'm um, just gonna remove this. Now please remove your friends if your friends book get full so that you can add more people into your friends book. And let's see if well, so I can remove. I'm just gonna remove that. And I'm really sorry if I remove you guys by accidentally. You can add me again, that's not a problem. So we're gonna remove that as well. And we're going to remove this and that as well. All right, let's see what else can I remove. All right, it's done. Let's remove this. And we're going to remove this as well. So I'm making a lot of space. And now you guys can actually add me. All right. Do I have any more to remove? Let's remove this. And I think I'm actually cool for the moment. I don't really need, need to remove anyone else. So yeah, it's kind of cool. Now I have like um, 15 more space. And if you guys want to add me, you can. So yeah, just send me a request and I will accept you. Then you'll be welcome to my friends bar. And I think that is all what I have done. So yeah, it's really cool. Now, by the recent update, the shape of the friends book has changed a little bit. You guys can see it's a little bit smaller and it looks more customized and fresh. Um, the same happened with a lot of different things in the game that has changed. Um, that I'll talk about later. So you guys can see it looks really, really cool. Now it looks a little bit smaller on the screen and I can manage it really more easily. So yeah, that was it for the friends book and your friends bar and your Haiti tag. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more of Haiti videos, then please subscribe, like, and comment. And I will see you soon with my next video. Till then, bye and see ya.